Hi guys, Ashantin here. How are you? I am near the nether tunnel that I have been building. This is my tunnel here. Let's just look at it from this perspective. And I've now built a tunnel to the skeleton farm. And this is the one that Jackson and I built and then Dorg refined. Now we have a bone line to it. So guys, starting from spawn here, bone line, the Jack Ash Skelly Spawner. And I've run the bone all along here. I've also started putting this lip, as David has in his tunnels. And then I, this sort of format, I have copied over here. Uh, but each bay has, thanks to Ben I, a redstone lamp in. And because I saw this on one of David's builds, I've fancied up the end of this with a redstone lamp. I've filled in a lot of the stuff behind. Uh, the, I was thinking of putting the nether brick on the ceiling, but frankly it was just going to look too dark. So I put the bone there, and funny enough it does give a sort of pattern in this bone, which is rather nice. So the bone leads to the skelly spawner. Yay! <laughs> that has taken me an astonishing amount of time to do. Let's just clear up after ourselves. However, through here, I have been smelting up nether brick like there's no tomorrow. And what I've done is I've been running down there and getting um, buckets of lava. And that has had an unexpected result. I found some nether quartz in the tunnels and also I had to fight off a ghast, so I acquired a ghast here. I've also found some red mushrooms, which I did not have funnily enough. So we have blocks of redstone left over, which is wonderful. Now, I remember thinking this tunnel was finished and then I came back and did more. And I'm not sure whether this tunnel is finished. I think it is. I think that it looks fairly elegant. I like the colour scheme. It has taken me ages to get all the brickwork. I don't think I've got a mistake, but some of the eagle-eyed amongst you might like to have a look at that. I don't think I need these torches, actually. I think they detract because we've got the redstone lamps in the ceiling there. Winnie, your pattern of surrounding something by, well, basically the 9 by 9 pattern, I was very interested to hear you like Sudoku, so do I, um, actually works amazingly well. This is all on the half slab as are our tunnels and these are slabs and steps so nothing should spawn here. And I filled in a lot of the holes behind it, so I'm hoping that no ghasts can spawn. So, guys, <laughs> that has been a long job. Believe you me, that's been a long job. But I think that our tunnel is looking a bit smarter now. I did find there was a hidden staircase down. I didn't explore that. And there is a sign here that says a hidden sign, so someone has a sense of humour. Uh, I don't think we need this sort of odd pink effect here. It depends on whether other people are going to put um, lines to their tunnels, because down here we've got... Who have we got down this tunnel? We have got um, Winnie, obviously. That's a smart tunnel. And Lobo is down here. I've been on with Lobo most of the morning, actually, and David's been on as well. So the three of us have been here. And then this is Jackson down here. I don't know what his colour is going to be. So I think we are... Oh, I don't want to show his tunnel off, because I know he's in the middle of building that. I don't like dark spots. I know nothing can spawn on here. I just don't like the darkness. It's ridiculous, isn't it, when you're in the nether? So I feel I have had a very very satisfactory morning. Now whether I will amend that tunnel at all I don't know. Let me know what you think guys. Do you think that's okay? 
I mean, just because I love certain colour schemes doesn't mean to see everybody else does. I must say, I am very tempted seeing the mess down there that the Garths have made. Um, let me just clear this up a bit. Take this back with me because I need some um, more netherrack anyway in my build. Um, guys, if you want to go down there and get lava and do some smelting, I have left. Um, let me take this back with me because I probably need it. A couple of buckets. There is a lava bucket here. Do not take the buckets, guys. They're my buckets. <laughs> but there's a bit here, you know, to start you off with. Um, it's not the... It is not the most safest of places down there. And certainly I'm not going down there now with everything I've got on me because I very nearly died down there to the ghast I was fighting off. I couldn't see it. Um, I don't know where it was, actually. Anyway, I came out and it was all right. So, let's go back home. And if anyone wants to use those buckets and that for smelting one there in the nether, do so. Wow, it seems a long time since I've been here. It's funny, you come back and you actually expect something to have changed. Why it should have done, I don't know because I haven't moved or haven't done anything. Have we got four melons and four pumpkins yet? We haven't. Hmm. It's interesting, isn't it? Maybe I've just not been here long enough for one of them to grow. Quick check. Nope, that's not empty. Ooh, listen to the growling under there. Guys, guys. Uh, dog, I'm going to complete my bridge to the spawn. I was horrified to see you swimming across to me. Wow. Yeah. Oh, look at the vines going up there. That's a nice effect, isn't it? Yeah, I'm glad I didn't put more on because they are, like some weeds, very, very invasive. Let's get our shulker box back on its little pedestal. Oh my goodness, what a morning I've had doing all that. You don't realise quite how much um, you are doing until you are sort of part of the way through it. What have I got in that box? Yeah, I thought I had you there. Uh, I've got mushrooms, nether brick fence, blue, good grief. There's everything here. Where's my redstone chest? Let's get the redstone back in and put my 19... As I said, I could not have done that this morning were it not for Benai's gift. So, Benai, your gift has been used. There's my special blocks. Your gift has been used to, for the benefit, for the greater good of everybody. That's quite a not gas tier. That's good, isn't it? Terracotta. Yeah, all looking good. We can sort all this out. Where do I... Where do I keep my thoughts? Do I keep it in here? I appear to. What I've got. Oh, I've got more here. Let's make that up. I wonder how much I've got. Is it, is it, is it four that make quartz? It is. Oh, thank goodness for that. I think it might be nine. You forget so much, don't you? There we go. That's better. That looks a bit better. Quartz is building up quite nicely. And we'll put our gas tier over here because that will help with fire protection. I would actually, my magnum with this, what does gas tiers do? They do something. I would quite like to frame that actually. <laughs> it was a hard fought battle. It was a hard fought battle. So I think until I need it, um, I might just frame that one. Um, why not? We should show off our triumphs, don't you think? So we'll keep that one there. <laughs> so we have a ghast head and a ghast tear now. None of this have I been trying for. It's just that when you're fighting your way through the nether, you pick up all sorts of things. So guys, I count that a very successful morning. Um, please, please let me know what you think of the nether tunnel and whether you think it's okay. And from my balcony, bye bye.